This video will show you how to install the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller. Included in the box are the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller, a tilt sensor, a power cable, and mounting hardware. Begin by installing the tilt sensor. To activate the tilt sensor, remove the battery protection pull strip. Attach the mounting plate to the top panel of the door using double-sided tape or the two mounting screws supplied. Snap the sensor to the mounting plate. Next, we will pair and install the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller. When pairing with the system, begin by plugging in the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller near your Z-Wave module. From the Virtual Keypad app, access the Doors tab and press the plus button. Give the device a name and tap Done. The app will then display Preparing to Add. Next, it will request that you press the button on the Z-Wave device. Press the button on your Z-Wave Garage Door Controller to load it into the system. You will then see Adding Device displayed on the screen. When the Z-Wave Garage Door is successfully added, the app will display Device Added. When installing the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller, remove power from the garage door opener. The Z-Wave Garage Door Controller can be mounted to the ceiling or to the garage door opener's hardware using the included brackets. Be sure the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller is clear of all moving parts of the garage door and that the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller lamp is visible in all door positions. Connect the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller connection wires to the push button wall console terminals on the garage door opener. Terminal names and locations vary by model, and either wire can connect to either terminal. Remove the screw from the 120 volt AC outlet faceplate. Secure the retaining bracket to the faceplate with the provided screw. Snap the power supply into the bracket while plugging it into the outlet. Plug the power cord into the input jack of the Z-Wave garage door controller. Use wire ties to secure excess wiring clear of all moving parts of the garage door and opener. Plug the garage door opener back in. To synchronize the system, use the garage door opener's push button to manually open and close the door. From the Virtual Keypad app, activate your garage door opener. The Z-Wave garage door controller will beep and flash for 5 seconds before it activates the door opener and open or closes the door. You have successfully installed the Z-Wave Garage Door Controller. For more information on this and other DMP products, visit DMP.com.